I'm a third generation farmer here in Arlington, Washington. My uh, grandparents bought our family farm in 1953. And now that I have kids, just teaching them, just like my dad taught me, to innovate and come up with new ideas to do with that ground. So if we don't have good, viable, connected farms, the reality of how incredibly delicate our food system is will be much more apparent. We're not going to be able to feed the world unless we can produce more food on less ground. And so why would we not put everything we have into producing food? The best way to help improve food resiliency is to open up data silos for more informed decision making. Many of these farms have no access to the internet, and so therefore they're not able to really leverage cloud computing and applications that can help them improve their outcomes. The goal was to enable that new innovation to take place here, and really it started with connectivity. So we connected the farms with 5G to see how that innovation is going to play out. All right, what we have here is a water sensor. This tells us how much water this tree needs. All this data comes in, gets processed with 5G. And we can look at our app and it says when to water. And so it's just gonna change the quality of the fruit, the size of the fruit. It's, it's just gonna give us the best apples you've ever tasted. They're actually seeing real-time insights on the health of their crops. That wasn't possible in a 4G world. 4G was very much just about the connectivity side. 5G starts to blur the line between connectivity and edge computing. Each individual tree gives us all that data. We have 4,000 trees. So that's large amounts of data being processed. You're not gonna do that with regular internet. So you have to be able to have a big, big pipe and a data center in order to process that much information. This year just reassured me that we were putting corn in with the ground temperatures at a, a level that the corn would be healthy. I knew that ground moisture levels were high and I was able to put less water on and still uh, keep the crop healthy. These are real big outcomes, simply unlocked just because you have more insight. We're taking all of the great things that farmers know about their land and crop production, we're augmenting it with data so they can be more informed in the moment. We're just in the beginning stages of bringing technology into agriculture. 5G and connectivity will really help farmers get more out of their fields, more production with better quality. That's what 5G will do. And we can't wait to continue unlocking new value that helps them improve not only their sustainability and food resiliency, but to also show their peers in the agriculture industry what's possible with technology. You can't be a farmer if you're not a hopeless optimist. Well, that's what I'm trying to pass on to, to my kids, to keep it so a guy can work hard and make a living and support his family farming. I want to keep that heritage alive as best I can.